Flight delays and cancellations piling up after the FAA ordering the grounding of certain Boeing 737 MAX 9 planes. And that includes flights right here in Phoenix. 14 United and Alaska flights, they have now been canceled from Phoenix Sky Harbor Airport. Spotted some Boeing 737 9 planes sitting at the airport here. Those planes that you see in this image, a likely part of the fleet that has now been grounded and are now waiting for some inspection. So the temporary grounding comes in the wake of ongoing safety inspections after a mid-flight blowout on an Alaska Airlines plane. Here's uh, what blew out here. You see the images. No passengers and crew were injured. That's a fortunate thing. Still, the National Transportation Safety Board is searching for a cause, especially since this plane just went into service back in November. The grounding also caused headaches for passengers whose flights are comprised uh, with some of the grounded planes. It's frustrating, but I mean, it's better they cancel it for safety instead of letting it happen again. So the part of the plane that blew out was a plugged emergency exit, and that missing door plug was found Sunday by a Portland area teacher in his backyard. So it just flew out from uh, the sky and dropped into that teacher's backyard. It could help investigators get a better idea of how this whole thing happened. Shares of Boeing tumbled 9% when the markets opened this morning. And I was looking on Twitter earlier this morning, Celeste, some man in Portland found a cell phone mm -hmm. that he believes was sucked out of the plane when they had that rapid decompression. Yeah, so that's wild. Been wild out there. So we're also learning that federal investigators are looking into a warning light on some of those planes. The NTSB says the Boeing 737 MAX 9 had experienced a pressurization warning light on three previous flights. So some airlines actually restricting that MAX 9 from making longer flights over water to Hawaii. As we said, both United and Alaska have grounded their fleet of 737 MAX 9. So if you are scheduled to fly with either of those airlines, double check with them just to make sure that you don't have any cancellations or delays.